What is up guys, it's Madman. We're back. I didn't expect to make another video today, but I've just been studying all day and stuff and I took a break and I'm so like obsessed with gambling and stuff. So what I did was I went and picked up a little bit more training and I pulled the 95 cutting in. So uh, obviously he goes for a little bit less now. Um, I've been trying to sell my Cunningham. Well, I'm not trying yet. Um, I've just been looking at his price. I was waiting for the night because this is where he's been around all day. I'm hoping that tonight he goes back up to like 8-ish is what I'm hoping. If he doesn't, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do. But his 95 is still 500k, which is nice. So I'll throw that up right now. Just a quick little update about like what I've just been doing. Um, super sweet. I think I did, this is like the second one I did today. Um, I'm, I've am i been like holding off doing my Sam Mills challenges just because I'm kind of lazy. But I think I'm about to start doing those because the 130 free, uh, free 130k really is nice. Um, but right there we just made 500k. Um, we also have a, the 91 I think. And then we have a Mark Clayton, which honestly, that's 10k training. I'll probably just quick sell that and hold the training. Since I made the coins I wanted to, I'll probably just hold my training as it is um, and then quick sell him. And then I'm just gonna leave it where I'm at. I'll have around 1.4 mil. If I sell this Cunningham, I'll be over two mil. Um, but I really don't know if his price is gonna drop more than this. I don't. Um, I hope it does because they did take Ultimate Legend packs out of the store. That is one thing I want to talk about really quick. First of all, we have a new flashback, but there's no Ultimate Legend packs. I obviously, you guys can see, I have definitely been gambling. Uh, game changers paid off Elite packs suck. Um, this is, guys, I don't think I showed you guys. This is the set I've been doing, the 83 plus Legend player. But since Ultimate Legend packs, oh wait, I don't even know if they're, they are, okay. So yeah. Okay, so they are in stores, but they're not, whatever. I don't know, I think we're gonna get a refresh version. This is just a quick little um, update. The market is starting to come down a little bit. Uh, it's definitely starting to move in the downward uh, position, I would say. Especially like look at these guys now obviously these are some of the ones that aren't as expensive or like needed but like These guys are coming down Terry was 700k this morning. So they're definitely coming down um, The other thing that it is coming down are 94s So 94s have been stuck around 140k for a while now you can see without even a filter They're at around 120 this Brian Bulaga was hitting 90 at some points um this Tristan Wirth, I'm just going to let you guys know right now, he's one of the cards I want to pick up. Uh, Jimbo is at that price as well. Running backs really haven't moved a whole lot. They're still around 120. Uh, Derrick Henry is not moving at all. What other position? Left ends usually can be pretty low. So 120, uh, it's not a bad training ratio. I didn't mean to click right as a linebacker here. They're very expensive. Um, let me just tell you guys really quickly. I don't want to make this too long. I was just giving you guys a quick update. So it's 120,000 coins is 20,000 training, which is a 6-0 training per ratio. 95s at around 150. That's the cheapest I've seen them, which is also 6. So 6 is where we are kind of stuck at right now. And hopefully that does move a little bit, but I really don't know. Um, one other thing I do want to cover, though, really, really quickly is... Um, him. Jimmy Garoppolo. Oh, well, okay then. As he sells in front of me for 340k for a Jimmy Garoppolo card. Uh, I... Uh, he gets Gunslinger and he gets Hero Master. I've seen a couple gameplays. If you guys want to see one, please let me know. But he doesn't look too bad. Apparently, his release is very similar to Ganon. I don't want another Ganon. Um. So personally, oh wait, Brady 148. Yeah. So cards definitely are coming down a little bit. 
Um, 96s aren't moving. All these cards. Alex Smith is just going down. Like, if you guys want to see Alex Smith instead of Cunningham, also let me know because that card doesn't look too bad either. Now, Cunningham, I kind of love. You guys saw the gameplay, so it's really hard for me to, like, get rid of him. I do need receivers. Uh, again, let me know what receivers you guys want to see on the team. Probably none of these guys is what you're going to be seeing. Actually, there's only one that you'll be seeing that I know for sure I want. That's Terry when I get my power-up pass. I'm getting Terry with my power-up pass. I don't care what anybody else says. That's the 96 I'm taking from a power-up pass. Um, as far as 97s and everything, who knows? Who cares? If we get a 97 overall power-up pass, that might be like a complete game-changer. I don't know. We don't have any We have Nambi. That's, I don't want that. Um... I don't know what 90 Bryant, no. I don't know what 97s I would actually go with. I don't think we have any tight ends. We have Vernon Davis, actually. But, <clears throat> again, if we get a 97 overall power pass, here's the problem with these high power passes. They are nice, but training is a pain. You know? So, like, yes, I can, like, I can get a power pass and I'll be happy, but actually get using it for those high overalls are so expensive that isn't worth it. And like, okay, maybe if we got a 97 power pass, I might just use it on Cunningham. That's why I want to sell him in case we do get it. Um, I'm surprised that the 95 isn't sold. I think they're just... I don't think it's worth it to do the set anymore. I would assume that's why the 91 hasn't sold either. Oh, well, that would be a reason why. I think it's this one. Yes. Okay. So, um, they're dropping a little bit. I'll just throw mine up. For a little less but uh anyways this was just a quick little update on what i've been doing i'm gonna get back to work and stuff i'm not really sure about what content i'm gonna bring you guys for the rest of the week tomorrow might just kind of be a dead day um maybe just like talking about hopefully we get some information and then maybe i'll talk about that if we don't get any information about the new series i really don't know what i'm gonna do actually i might have an idea but anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this little update. Uh, me making tons of coins on the budget squad. If you did like this video, please drop a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.